hi everyone welcome back to my channel this is abby word today i'm gonna show us how to make this beautiful lovely elastic baby hairband if you have not subscribed to my channel please do that let's get started here are the things needed for the hairband i have a scuba scuba fabric um doll face Some patches I cut out from um, lace fabric. My tape. Elastic band, a wide one. And my needle and thread. First of all, um, this um, hairband is going to be for a baby girl of um, um, the, between the age of... Um, one and a half to two years so the head measurement is um 19 inches so all i need to do is to take that 19 inches of the elastic like this here is my 19 okay let me turn it like this here is 19 inches of the elastic now i will remove three inches from it okay because if i use it it will be too big for the child you know it's supposed to be firm and i don't want to remove more than three inches because i don't want it to be too tight since it's a child okay so i will just some um, count three from that my 19 i'll count one two three so it means i have 16 so i'll just cut it out from here this 16 then here i have my elastic already then for the um fabric i'm going to use this um um doll face so i i already cut out the measurement let me just um, confirm it for you i have um four and a half inches as the width then the length of it is um let's see the length is 29 29 inches 29 okay so you can take um, any measurement of your choice actually depending on how um gathered you want it to be around the elastic okay then this scuba uh okay first of all what i need to do here is just to fold it and um, turn it like this i will bring it together like this okay that's i'm putting the um, right side of the fabric inside like this so i'll simply go ahead and use my sewing machine now to stitch it from here till i get to the end okay i succeeded in um, stitching it i started from one end here i stitched like this then straight down so this way i'm going to turn it now i will simply open it and um, hold it like this then um, use my um, scissors to turn it inside out okay this is what I have so they can be neat that's why I have to um turn it inside here so that it will be easy for me to turn now that i want to put the elastic inside i just have to open it up another method you can as well um put the elastic inside and stitch okay then turn it but i think this is um is better for me so i'll just um, cut it like this so that will be easy for me to put the elastic inside okay Here's what I have. You can see the way it's folding already. This is the beauty of it. So now I will just um, put one inside the other one now. Ensure that um, they are facing the same side. What I mean by that is um, um, I don't want it to turn, turn, maybe turn like this. Let it be on the same line like this. You arrange it neatly and um, stitch. You can either stitch it with your machine or your needle and thread. Okay. Here is it. I succeeded in um, stitching it across like this. So with the elastic inside. So I'll just leave my needle here. Then the next thing to do is to cut out some um, my scuba so what i need to do is to fold it first of all in half like this 
then I'll fold again like this. I want it to be in form of a circle. So I'll just um, take measurements of um, three inches. You can take less than that and you can also take more than that. So I'll mark my three inches here. So just um, start it from this very end here, this beginning point and start marking three round the place like this. So this is um, my last three. Thereafter, I'll just cut it out. Here is it after cutting it out. You can see it's looking like a cone. Then I'll open it up like this. Can you see? That's a perfect cycle. So all I need to do now is to um, fold it like this. From one end to the other, okay? So I'll just kind of start folding to give it the kind of design I want. Can you see that? Like a bow tie. So I'll just um, stitch this midpoint now. Meanwhile, my needle is still um, here attached here, so I'll just uh, kind of uh, stitch it with it like this. You can decide which way you want it to face, either to be like this or to be like this. I think like this is better instead of this, like this is better for me. So when I stitch, I take it down the main um, band, bring it up again, then stitch again so that it can be firm a little. Now I'm going to place this patch on top here, but I think it's too big. I just want to remove this um, middle one and um, attach it there. So I'll just trim it out. Trim it off. I've succeeded in trimming it out, so I'll just um, place it on top of this um, midpoint like this. Then just um, stitch it with it again. You can as well use them um, glue, okay? It's not necessary to stitch this very part. You can as well use glue to just to attach it. It's done. I don't want to leave this um, place plain like this, okay? So I just want to embellish it further. This was what I got, what I cut out, you know? I, I removed this initially, okay? This was it. So I'll just trim off this uh, excess net now and place it here. Here's it. After cutting out, I'll just um, add some glue. Not so much. You can see it. Wow, is this not beautiful? 
you will not even know that the scuba that is under it, the way I covered it up, is looking so, um, entirely different. Wow, this is amazing. So one more thing, um, this rough part where I stitched, I'm simply going to cover it up, okay? So I just um, folded and um, cut a little piece of this um, doll face. So I folded it, um, folded the four edges. Then I will just um, add some glue and cover that place up so that no one will know what happened there. that your work or your work should be always neat very neat inside and outside okay that's how to know a professional then if you have a label you can also stick it here this is amazing you could make something like this to supply some shops package it for, uh, very well and use for um baby um gifts either um newborn baby or birthdays can you imagine that? Wow, this is lovely. Hmm. Can you see it on my baby's hair? Wow, she's so cute with it. Have you learned something new today? If yes, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell. See it on her. Wow, this is amazing. You can see the beautiful dress was also made by Avery Words. Wow. Baby, turn your back so they can see. Wow, this is lovely. If you want to learn how to make this same um, dress, kindly let us know in the comment section, okay? This is fantabulous. <laughs> I'm loving this. I'm loving this. Bye from Abbey Ridge.